your best face forward do dolly a little bit different than any moisturizer moisturizer this is passion i cannot speak today passion fruit from a skincare routine like <coughs> excuse me Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about a new skincare line that I have been loving. Um, about a year and a half ago maybe I filmed my skincare routine video and a lot has changed since then so I did want to talk about the new skincare I have been loving. Um, and that brand is the Formula 10.0.6. I don't know if that's like how you say it um, but that's just what the brand is. So the first thing by them that I've been loving is their Best Face Forward Daily Foaming Cleanser. And this one is Passion Fruit and Green Tea. This fresh foaming gel cleanser washes away oil and impurities for a sparkling clear complexion. Um, I absolutely love this stuff. It smells amazing. It's very gentle. I have sensitive skin and I have had no problems with this whatsoever. Um, and like I said, it smells really good, which I like. It is kind of um, like a stronger scent, but since it smells like grapefruit and like green tea, it's not perfumey or anything like that. Um, it's actually just really nice. I enjoy the scent. I think it's a great face wash for summer too because when I wash my face in the morning, I feel like that grapefruit and green tea scent just kind of helps wake me up. Um, I don't know. That's probably all in my head, but I have really been loving this. It keeps my skin really clear. Um, it has a really good lather to it, so it's not like it's... I. I don't really like the face washes that you like rub it in your hands and like it doesn't get foamy. Um, so this one does do that. I oh yeah, I have been absolutely loving this face wash. The next thing from Formula 10 is um, their 3 times Sublime. And this is 3-in-1 Blackhead Wash, Scrub, and Mask. Pink, Grapefruit, and Jojoba. I have no idea. This stuff is amazing. Again, it does have a scent to it smells so fresh like I feel like this one smells mostly like the pink grapefruit although I don't know what the jojoba is um, but it just smells really fruity really refreshing I have been absolutely loving this I have been using this about two times a week and I have been loving it I will get out of the shower when my face is still kind of just like a little bit damp I will apply this all over my face um, just around my eyes and my mouth obviously and I will let it dry so I will brush my hair and do all of that and then once it's dry I will go back to the sink and just kind of get my hands wet and then I will massage the mask into my face. It has these little beads in it and once it's sat on your face, the beads kind of um, like disintegrate a little bit so it's not as rough on your skin and then if you go to kind of like massage it after you've let the mask set, it's very gentle but it exfoliates your face so well. My face is so soft afterwards. Um, I would honestly do this like four or five times a week if it wasn't bad for your skin to exfoliate that much. Um, I do love exfoliating though. I just feel like my face looks so fresh afterwards and it gets all the dead skin off, which feels really good. So I definitely recommend this face mask. Next face mask by Formula 10 is the Keep Your Cool Skin Calming Gel Mask. And this says coconut and cucumber. This unique gel mask helps reduce the appearance of nasty breakouts. Coconut soothes blemishes while refreshing cucumber helps calm even the most angry of flare-ups. I also, I do want to mention really quickly as I'm reading this, um, I love their packaging and their wording and they kind of have fun with their products which I really enjoy and like the colors and I like how everything kind of like matches. They do like their packaging all the same. Um, they just do different colors and all of that and it's kind of like a matte finish on their packaging. So I did want to mention that. I love the packaging of it. It is a squeeze tube which um, this squeeze tube I actually prefer over any squeeze tube that I've ever used like when you open it it's not like pouring out and you're like oh oh like the product is thick enough and the um, packaging is just made really well so I just wanted to throw that out there really quickly but this keep your cool skin calming gel mask is really really great I prefer if you're just gonna buy one mask I prefer this one just because I like to exfoliate um, but this one does feel really good it has that kind of like cooling feeling on your face and um, you just kind of let it set for about 10 minutes and then rinse it off. Your skin feels really soft and moisturized. Um, so I've been really enjoying this. This also has a scent to it. This one tastes, tastes like, <laughs> I haven't tasted this. I don't know what it tastes like. This one smells like cucumber and oatmeal, if that makes sense. It has like a very 
subtle, I don't know, like warm smell to it almost. Mostly cucumber. Um, but yeah, it smells really good and it's really gentle on your skin as well. So the next two things I want to talk about are moisturizers. So the first moisturizer I tried by Formula 10 is the Picture Perfect Day Daily Moisturizer with SPF 15 Broad Spectrum Sunscreen. And this is guava and vitamin C. This stuff smells so good. Like I want to eat it and I want to put it all over my body. Is that weird? Um, I've really been loving this sunscreen. I posted a picture of it on my Instagram and for sunscreen, this is the best smelling sunscreen I've ever used. It has the best formula and it does not leave your skin greasy. Also, you know when you get sunscreen like you put it all over your face and it starts to like kind of get into your eye and it burns like hell. This does not burn. It's so gentle and it doesn't feel like sunscreen, which I love. Um, you don't get that nasty, greasy like sunscreen feel or smell or anything like that. So I've really been loving this. I recommend this for summer. I will put it all over my chest and even on my shoulders if I have like a tank top on. I will be using this for my like holy grail SPF from now on. The next thing I want to talk about is their Seriously Shine Free Moisturizer. Um, it says Mattifying Oil Free Aloe Vera and Bamboo. This is, let me just say, this stuff feels really weird. When you put it on your hands, it's kind of like a gel cream moisturizer. And then you rub it on your skin, it feels normal. But once it starts to dry, it dries really fast. So when you put it on your face, you like, you know how moisture you can usually like keep rubbing it in? There comes a point where you can't rub this in anymore. It is like on your skin and it's there to stay. So um, that is obviously what gives it the shine free um, effect. But it is just kind of a little bit different than any moisturizer. moisturizer. Moisturizer I have ever used. I cannot talk today guys. I'm so sorry. Also, I have to be to work soon So I'm kind of talking really fast um, But yeah, it just kind of has a different feeling than most moisturizers in my opinion It's like not slippery so your foundation doesn't slip around while you're applying it It just goes on flawlessly and I love that so this I really recommend this smells really good as well This one I would say has the most subtle smell out of all of them, but very very good. Really good. I really love it. All of Formula 10's products are like under $10, which is amazing. For the quality that you get in these products, it is so worth it. Most of them range around like $6.50. So, so affordable and really high quality. Um, I just wanted to throw that out there, but if you guys are not ready to jump on the bandwagon and try all these products, um, they do get a clean they do get a they do make a clean getaway package so in this package you get the formula 10 best face forward daily foaming cleanser and this is just their regular cleanser the one that I talked about in the beginning super wonderful so it's great you get like a little travel pack to try out by the way guys this video is not sponsored I honestly just love these products so the next thing that you get in here is the formula 10 so totally clean deep pore cleanser and this you just put on like a little cotton plaid it's like plaid oh my gosh I literally cannot speak today I don't even I don't even understand the next thing in here is the so totally clean deep pore cleanser and this is just something you put on like a little cotton pad and use almost like a toner it's an acne treatment it says helps clear acne pimples blackheads and whiteheads so this stuff is really good um it it's not my favorite toner in the world, but I really like it. I would still use it if it was the only one out there. And I just like a toner that makes my skin feel like so cold and almost like it's like burning off. I don't know why, I just love that feeling. I'm like, oh my gosh, my face is so clean. Um, but this is just a little bit more gentle, which is good because I feel like if you have sensitive skin, you probably shouldn't be using something that's so harsh. Okay, I've only used it two or three times now, um, but I think it was a good enough amount of time to see if I really liked it. I didn't break out or I didn't have any problems with this. And then you get this mask that's Pore, Pore Be Pure Skin Clarifying Mud Mask. And this is Strawberry and Yarrow. I don't know what that is. And this stuff is... So wonderful. I love this face mask. It smells just like strawberries. It smells so good. I love that they make their stuff smell good, but it's not perfumey. It doesn't feel like it's going to be harsh on your skin. It smells like natural things. So it's, to me, like it's not bothersome at all. Some products, if they smell florally or like perfumey, I don't like that. But since these smell like natural 
like fruits and things that come from the earth. It just smells really good and I really enjoy that. So this comes in the little travel pack, which I love. And then the last thing that comes in the little travel pack is ooh, the Keep Me Clean Clarifying Facial Wipes. These are great. I personally don't really use makeup wipes. I just wash my face off and then use the toner to get the rest of my makeup off. Um, and that works for me. But when I do need a makeup wipe, I tried these when I was um, away for a wedding that I was in. And um, I brought this with me for the hotel room. And I tried these and I really, really liked them. Um, very gentle very describe the smell they don't really smell like much actually these don't smell like much at all but and this is cucumber and witch hazel which I actually love that this has witch hazel in it that's really great for your skin and um, so I'm glad that they included that this doesn't smell like much it's very light scented and um, I really enjoy using these even though I don't really use makeup wipes but I would totally recommend these so I think that's great that they have like a little travel pack that way even if you aren't traveling you could try this little pack and you get four of their products to try out generally if you like this whole pack you're probably gonna like the rest of the line um, so I think that's great. And this, when I was at Ulta, I don't remember if it was on sale or not, but I think this retailed for like $9.99. It was right around $10. I think that is a great value, especially to try something out. It may be worth it because it may become your new favorite skincare line. So to me, that is totally worth it. That is absolutely it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.